Hi everyone. Right, this is the, I've decided to do a few videos about terrain and making terrain. Um, I've got a bit of time on my hands now, as we all have, um, for one reason or another. But, so I thought, I'm going to fill my time with doing a, bit, a few more tutorials. Now these are all going to be quite basic builds, but they're not going to be scale model standard or golden demon standard they're just something that i want to share with you that i've done that are cheap as chips and will look quite good on the table so i thought i'd start first of all with this this is what's called a nissan hut now a lot of them were used by both by all sides in in world war ii and it's just basically a corrugated corrugated iron um, steel container or building shed storage unit um, they were used to so many different things and there's so many different div designs but I thought I'd do quite a basic design and just show you how I've done it so here's your once round so there we go that's that's all I've done and I think they I think they're really effective and really quite good for what they are um so yeah there so that's the finished one um and i've done it in a dark green color just to make it sort of generic and then i can use it wherever um so that's the finished product so what i started with was this cardboard tube we've all had them delivering poles or whatever and um, posters so I just got one that was four inch in diameter, cut it down the middle, and then just put a piece of board in the bottom, like that, and that's it. That's how I start. Then, the next bit is a cut. Two bits of foam board, one for either end. So that'll slot in there, and that'll slot in that end. And then, in true Blue Peter style. Yeah, it'll look like that. See? So, you've got a real basic shape. Basic thing, all sealed off. Then it's like that. So, super, super easy to do. Not, not difficult, very inexpensive. I mean, we've all had posters and just saving this. And I've cut that to six inches long, 150 mil. Um, so, and then I've all I did was cut some windows and just mark out on there a doorway because I, I'm just going to keep it shut like that one there. And then all I do is put a door frame in. You can cut out the doorway and um, have it open if you want. I just didn't fancy it. So, then the next stage is to cover it in corrugated. So it looks like a corrugated steel container. There. Right. So what this is, this is, this is a sort of, I bought this from a, from a place called Hobbycraft. Now this was for the kids. And all it is is corrugated paper. And I, I think you get like six sheets, A4 sheets for a pound from Hobbycraft. Now, typically, I've run out, um, or the kids have run out, and I've just been using offcuts, and I've saved them all here. Just lots of, they get lots of different colours, because what I thought you could do, I did this here all in one sheet there. One sheet, one sheet on there, and then there. So then if you look at the front, I've done it in various bits. It doesn't matter. Um, but you could always do like patched up bits or smaller segments with all these little bits. So that's why I've kept these. And there you go, that's it. I mean, it's corrugated, it's got some holes for the window, and I've just framed the door, that's it. And then I just put it on a base. Because, to be fair, all I used was um, hot glue. And the first one, hasn't happened on the second one, but that one, it warped slightly because of the hot glue. But putting on it in a base has sorted that out so 
There we go. And then when I painted it up, I've tried a bit of um, rust, if you notice down the sides. Oh, it looks quite, quite good. So, there you go. And that you can use for Pacific Theatre, World War II, Northern Europe, Britain, desert, anywhere. Um, you can, you, if you wanted to, you can put windows in the side, a little chimney in the top, because they were used as barracks in various places. Um, but I've just gone for a basic model at the moment, and I think it's come out well. And I think probably in total, less than a pound. And that, to make, from that, there, to that, all finished. So from there to there took me an hour at most but then from, and then you could, to get to there that's however long you want to take so that's it so there's the first tutorial um i hope you like it and i hope you find it useful all right i'll speak to you soon bye